Well, what a surprise. Wealth creators, wealthy entrepreneurs and wealthy families are leaving Britain in droves, according to research carried out by leading migration consultancies and tax specialists widely reported across the UK media today. Astonishing! I mean, who could have predicted that when Rishi Sunak backstabbed his way into Downing Street and walloped us all with extreme punishing taxation, everyone with a bit of cash was going to quickly scoff or off to somewhere with a government that wasn't hell-bent on thieving all their hard-earned money off them. It's bad news for businesses, it's bad news for workers, and it's bad news for all of our bank balances. When you raise taxes way beyond what's fair and reasonable, and way beyond the levels that citizens are being charged in other countries, who could have predicted that all of this nation's most valuable people, the people with skills and assets, would go and live somewhere where they feel like they're being a bit less mugged? Well, frankly, a 16-year-old with a C-grade maths GCSE could have predicted it. What in God's name does Rishi Sunak think attracts wealthy people to this country, if not tax incentives? Well, I can tell you, it's not the climate, Rishi. You can have that startling revelation for free. No one's coming to live here for the interminable grey skies, wind and rain, mate. Do they come here because of the UK's famously good-looking people and its sophisticated cultural landscape? Probably not, as the country is seemingly now populated by fat trannies peddling child-grooming communist propaganda in every regional art centre and public library. A wealth creator is attracted to the UK for its world-beating health service. Well, no, because the UK no longer has a health service to speak of, just numbers you can ring and be put on hold, and waiting rooms you can sit in for hours on end before explaining your medical issues to someone with dubious medical qualifications from another continent who doesn't seem to speak the same language as you, let alone have the capacity to provide you with any solutions. The only possible reason why talented, skilled world creators would want to live in this country is if you give them excellent financial incentives to do so, Rishi. Frankly, it would take a pronounced degree of mental subnormality not to comprehend that. And yet you pushed our taxes through the roof nonetheless. And now your tax yield is going to be even less than it was to begin with, because anyone with any money is leaving the country. And let's not forget, Rishi, whilst all this country's most valuable citizens run away, every week thousands of freeloaders and criminals arrive in dinghies along our coastline to replace them, and you do nothing about it. Are you deliberately trying to run this country into the ground, Rishi? Are you in the pocket of your globalist mates? Why is it that you hate Britain so much that you're trying to turn us into one of the world's most impoverished countries? Please do let us all know, if you get a moment, when you're not too busy destroying this once great nation. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe, support my content by following the links below this video, watch my return to stand up now available to view on the Comedy Unleashed YouTube channel, a link for which you can also find beneath this video.